Oh, one. Good morning, Blue Devils. Today is Friday, October 1st, and welcome back to the School News. We are your hosts, Olivia and Caroline, and this is your news. Big news. Students will now have the entire week of Thanksgiving off. Superintendent Liggins announced that last night we will have no school on November 22nd and 23rd, giving us the whole week off. COVID cases are nearing an all-time high and wearing a mask is required in all Fayette County public school buildings. Everyone is being asked to wear one to protect lives. And Fayette County Public Schools has opened a testing site at the Old Herod Leader Building on the corner of Main and Midland, open seven days a week from 2 to 6 p.m. Don't leave it a chance. If you've been exposed to someone with COVID, get tested ASAP. The Gary R. Martin College Fair is happening next week on Monday, October 4th, at 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. at Rupp Arena, multiple colleges will be setting up stands for students to learn about all different colleges that are offered. Admission is free and it is a great opportunity for any, any Henry Clay student. Juniors interested in applying for the Governor's Scholar Program need to attend an info session. Choose one meeting October 4th, 5th, or 6th during advisory or Tuesday, October 5th at 8 a.m. All meetings will be in the Henry Clay Library. More info on the counseling webpage. Did you know that we offer a free food backpack program? It is a bag of food items such as noodles, chips, granola bars, etc. for any student needing additional food. Pick up days or Thursdays in Ms. Bowman's room and you can just grab one and go. The PSAT is coming on Wednesday, October 13th in the gym for all of those who have signed up. If you signed up, you should have gotten a booklet from your advisory teacher. If any students are interested in attending the annual UK Mr. and Mrs. Black pageant next Tuesday, October 5th at 7 p.m., um, let Ms. Bowman and Ms. Alman know. Anyone interested in volunteering at the UK alumni basketball game next Wednesday, October 6th at 7, let Ms. Bowman or Ms. Alamine know. Now on to clubs. Chess Club is back and now seeing new members. They meet every Wednesday after school in room 165, Ms. Zender's room. No experience necessary. Today, from 3.15 to 4 on, in room 24, there will be the first French Club meeting of the year. There will be food, introduction games, French stuff, and more. All are welcome to come and enjoy. Harambe will begin meeting on October 12th at 3.30 in room 32. If you would like to participate this year on Henry Clay's academic team, please contact her bright in room 26 and or Miss Richmond in room 114 before the end of the day, October 1st. That is today. We now have information about the league and several upcoming events. We have girls mentoring group that meets on Wednesdays after school at 3.30 p.m. If you're interested, let Miss Bowman know. You can stop by her office or email. Room number is 129A. Now on to sports. The girls' soccer team beat Bryan Station on their senior night, 7-0, on Wednesday. Congrats to all the senior girls, and best of luck in your district opening round next Tuesday at 6. The bowling team needs you. Yes, you. Come out for practice on October 24th, and if you have what it takes, if you have any questions, see Coach Smith in room 105. The varsity team is back in action this Friday after a two-week hiatus. This will be at Bryan Station, and they are taking on the defenders. Kickoff is at 6.30 p.m., and we would love to have the whole student body out there to support them. Go Devils! Esports will meet in room 102, Yellow Hallway, upstairs at 3.30 p.m. on Thursdays. Great. Games will be played, Smith League of Legends, Super Smash Bros., Splash Aton, FIFA, Madden, and Rocket League. We welcome all to come and participate. This has been your news for today. I am Olivia, or I'm Caroline. And I'm Olivia. Reminding you to never be blue. And